Hi, I'm Dr. Mary Renzel. I'm here to talk to you about BrainFresh. So what is BrainFresh? Well, it's a company I started because I'm a neuroimmunologist, you know, a brain dog and a coach and a mom of four. And I have been through nearly 30 years of working in medicine. And there's just so many emotions that go along with working in medicine. There's a lot of system challenges, right? So we're really our heart is trying to help people, but yet the day-to-day -day work can be hard because there's just, you know, you get into tough situations in supporting people when they're in tough situations. Um, so I thought, you know, what, what would be really great is if we could maximize how our brain works and what it needs so that we could keep going and we can feel good and we can do what we need to do along the way of working in medicine so that we don't get to the end, like, oh, I'm exhausted. I'm burned out. I'm tired, I'm depressed, I'm, you know, any of those kind of things, you know, so I wanted to provide tools to folks who are either learning it, how to be, um, you know, have a role in medicine or are in medicine, or any kind of learners in medicine, um, so that we can figure out what do we need to do day to day, just to really support our brain. Um, so I came up with Synapse, it's a brain based time management um, system, so that we can learn how to flex you know, our, your neural powers uh, every day so that we can really work optimally and increase our productivity. Um, we can learn how to clarify our, um, our neural gifts, uh, our neural strengths, um, so that you can have more focus in your day. You're not trying to do everything. Uh, sometimes society tells us we can do everything and we don't really want to do everything. We want to do what we're good at, what we enjoy, what we feel really passionate about. And we wanna learn how to launch our neuroplasticity, right? We wanna remember that we're always learners, that we can keep moving, we can keep restructuring, we can reevaluate, keep going. Um, so that's what my Synapse course does, is it walks you through all of these ways to tap into your neuroscience um, powers uh, to use today, okay? So, you know, I remember a story in medicine when I was an intern. So for those of you that are not in medicine yet, you know, that's your first year um, when you're on the wards in the hospital and you have some responsibility a little bit, but you're still learning a lot. And it's really a shocking time emotionally because you're really with patients when they're going through really hard times. And I remember this one um, young guy, he had my same birth year, um, but he had a muscle disease and he wasn't intubated yet, but he was able to breathe on his own. But I remember him laying in bed and being on pillows and um, you know, not having much, much muscle mass anywhere, but his brain was fine. He was talking to us and he had a great sense of humor and the social worker said to me, why don't you go tell him that he's, um, you know, he's probably not going to live a long life because his muscles that help him breathe aren't going to last forever there. He's getting weaker every day. And I, you know, I looked at his chart and I saw that his birth year was my birth year. And um, I talked to him about like what he wanted out of life and what was important to him. And he wanted to have a family and, you know, live a normal life. And that was just crushing. And because right at that time, this is gosh, almost 30 years ago, there wasn't any treatment for his kind of muscle disorder. And I just remember thinking, wow, like, how can I help this guy? And he was such a nice guy. He was so easy to talk with. He was super friendly. And, and yet he had this really hard disease and we were supposed to help him through that. And I wasn't sure how to do that. Um, and so I just remember that being such a tough situation. And I think that that situation showed me that life is precious. So if I say I'm grateful for anything in medicine, it's that medicine has showed me life is precious and every day shows me life is precious. It's never uh, anything that we can take for granted because every day, you know, we see somebody who's struggling with something that they didn't expect to happen in their life. Um, so I think that's um, generally a gift that medicine gives us um, to those that work in medicine so that we know that life is precious. Um, and that's another reason that I built Synapse, um, this time management course, because uh, really, you know, we have to, in a perfect world, we wake up every day and we see that that day is the only that day that we'll get and that will be the, this age, like this is the day I have today. I'll only be this age at this moment, one time. I'm recording this video with you guys because I feel strongly that these are tools that we can all use um, to just really, you know, just have more tools in our life so that we can live how we really want to live. Um, and what does that mean? You know, what is important to you? So in this course, we're going to outline, you know, how to set up our priorities. What are your priorities? What are your personal gifts? 
how to really focus on those so that you don't waste time on things that you're just not good at that take your tons of time. Um, and then like how to value that neuroplasticity, how to reach and stretch and keep doing new things where you're learning um, and we're encouraging other learners. So optimal kind of growth mindset is that we encourage learning. Uh, we honor that because learning is actually a vulnerable state. So we have to admit we don't know something and that's not usually what we do in medicine. We usually say we're doctors, we know X, um, this is what we know. We went to medical school. We went to so much, so many years of school. Um, and so, yeah, being vulnerable and learning is a tough one for us sometimes. So I hope you think about and check out my course called Synapse, um, where we really honor the value of our days and our time. Uh, we learn how to really um, focus, to be productive and be creative um, with our special time, right? So just reach out and I'm glad to answer any questions. Thanks for listening.